Hello, I'm Michelle with two L's. And I'm Natalie the Red. And we are Force of I Entertainment. And today we are here to give you our review, our thoughts of the new Daily Wire film, Am I Racist? Starring Matt Walsh. Uh, we already kind of, we are actually, we went into this movie in detail. I'll link it below in our last live stream. Uh, I just wanted to actually make a video as I see that so few critics will even touch this movie. I thought it, I thought I've now seen this movie twice and I feel it is worthy of being addressed. So that's why we're, we're, we're coming back. We're going to make yes. an actual video on it. Uh, give you our thoughts. I also saw that fellow YouTuber, much, much larger YouTuber. Yes. Uh, Jeremy Johns did a video and, and is kind of under attack because he liked a movie he watched and reviewed. And quite frankly, I think that's so absurd that I wanted to make this video because the more the internet tells me what I can't do, the more I'm just going to do that because that's irrational. Uh, so I want to give our thoughts on Am I Racist? Again, a Daily Wire Matt Walsh film. I do want to go ahead and give this disclaimer. Uh, I uh, I did not see, this is his second movie. He did uh, What is a Woman? That was a documentary. I did not see that movie. Uh, I'm not subscribed to the Daily Wire's content. Uh, I also think for this yeah, review, for this review, I want to give this disclaimer that I don't follow Matt Walsh on Twitter. Don't I, me neither. You know, yeah. I'm not trying to knock the guy. I just, you know, I, I'm trying to get that across. Of it's not like I went into this like some big fan. Like, oh man, his next masterpiece. Yes. Like, in fact, he may or may not be muted on my <laughs> on my ex account. But uh, so, with that in mind, I want to give you our thoughts. My initial re again, I've now seen this twice, but my initial reaction when I saw this the first time was. That was one of the funniest movies I've seen all year. That, yeah, really. That was my take. Natalie, what were your initial thoughts on it? Yeah, I just, I was very entertained. Uh, I had a really good time with it. Yes. Yeah, I had such a good time. I took her her daughter, my niece, uh, to see it. I saw it again yesterday and found it just as funny a second time watching this, this movie. Uh, of course, this movie is kind of, it's basically a mockumentary is what it is. And it is dealing with the subject of racism and, and maybe those that are making a lot of money off of keeping racism alive right. and, and well in this nation. Uh, but I'm going to give you now what we like about this movie. Uh, I, again, I just, I, I have not laughed this much in a while at a theater. There yeah. were laughs from start to finish. Uh, there are a few scenes where I was genuinely cracked up uh, watching this again, this mockumentary style kind of Borat style uh, filmmaking that they are doing in this, and, and it's mostly Matt Walsh's dry humor uh, with these these people that he is interviewing that are DEI experts <laughs> and are trying to explain to him what, how America is a systematically racist country. Uh, so I really enjoyed that. I also, there, there really is, again, there's tons of laughs to be had in this movie. There are. Uh, but also there's, there's genuinely some heartfelt moments. Again, I've seen this twice now and there's, there's one scene in particular that brought tears to my eyes both times because in all this talk of racism, he does go out and begin to talk to the everyday American. Uh, he goes to a vet, it's a veterans bar somewhere in the South. Yeah. Uh, he speaks to a a black gentleman who is an immigrant from another country. And he talks about how great America is and how we all bleed the same color and basically just kind of love and, and how that's kind of what, what gets to actually goes against real racism uh, in this movie. Right. Uh, so I thought this movie actually has a good message. And that's why if you're someone here and you've not seen it, you can't really comment on it uh, on what you, if this movie, you know, people are just saying, Oh, race, it's a racist movie. No, it's actually very much uh, not a racist movie. It's very oh. much a movie that has a message of all of us coming together, that we do all bleed the same. Uh, and yeah. Yeah, I don't think there's anything racist potentially mm. about it. It's just exposing uh, things that probably need to be exposed. In fact, I would and, say it's actually... they're exploiting, you know, that topic and for wrong reasons. In fact, I, I would say some of the people that he interviews in this are the real racist, As I, right. especially as I went back and watched the second time. I'm not really sure how certain people can tell all white people how we feel and think. Uh, you know, I feel, I feel that's racist, quite frankly, if we're being real. Um, but yeah, I, I really just enjoyed this movie. I highly recommend it. I recommend it if, you know, 
It doesn't matter where you fall on the political spectrum. I genuinely recommend seeing this for yourself. I think it starts a very good dialogue uh, that, that we could have in this country. But overall, I just had a really fun time. It was really funny. Because it is, like you said, there are heartwarming moments mm -hmm. and there are informative moments. And there are a lot of, you know, like we touched on, a, a lot of laughs and a lot of comedy moments. And I think that's why this will kind of have more of a rewatchability factor yes. because it's almost like little skits broken down. If yes. you think about it, like little comedy segments, you know, maybe unintentionally for it to be as funny as it was. Or I mean, I'm sure it's they, funny. they wanted funny. it to be funny or, you know, he wanted it to be funny, but yeah, it, it definitely uh, definitely is a lot of the time. So Yeah, so I don't really find this movie. What's so funny is, is critics aren't even giving it a chance and doing their job to watch it. And it almost feels like one reason they may not is because if they did, they would have to get it, give it a good view, right. a good review, because this is a well-made mockumentary. It that is. is yeah. That is very entertaining at the end of the day. Uh, again, I've seen it twice and I, I highly recommend it. I think it's a very good film, very funny film. And again, heartfelt uh, right. a film. So I, I really enjoyed Am I Racist? I, I think I it's... I did too. I, uh, I, so how would I rate this uh, on a level five being the max level of hoots for a mockumentary? Yeah. I'm going to give this five out of five hoots. I here, really. I thoroughly enjoyed this movie. And again, I think it's silly that for people who won't even watch the movie to review it, I think it's silly for anyone to comment that someone is racist. Uh, you know, shout out to Jeremy John just because he watched and enjoyed the movie. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Uh, that's so silly. That's absolutely absurd. Come on, be fair. Yeah, that's definitely not the definition of racism, uh, whether or not you want you like this movie. But uh, yeah, that's our thoughts on a Matt Walsh's new film, Am I Racist? Uh, so what do you guys think? Have you seen this movie? Have we convinced you to see this movie? Uh, well, share your thoughts below. And if you have not yet, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Also give this video a thumbs up. And as always, ladies and gentlemen, remember to be a force of light. All right. Bye, guys. Bye.